Well, ladies and gentlemen, welcome to Training Thursday and Carrie. Uh, this is our fifth time trying to record this due to some technical issues. It is. It is indeed. This time is going to work. Folks, if you've seen this, send us a message. Let us know we're okay. No, uh, <laughs> we, know, we know this one's going to work. We know this yeah. one's going to work. I'm Jordan okay, Bateman. Yeah. I'm Jordan Bateman. I am the Director of Communications for the Independent Contractors and Businesses Association. Joined as always by Carrie Vital, the project coordinator for the training department at ICBA. Vital by name, vital by nature. Absolutely. All right, we're talking about uh, emotional intelligence. Indeed, we are. And this is a new course offered by ICBA, uh, half day workshop, July 24th in Burnaby. Mm -hmm. um, and I like the tagline the myths and the mastery. It's pretty entertaining. Sounds like a Game actually. of Thrones uh, title there. So that is true. So tell me a little bit about emotional uh, quotient. Um, give me my uh, uh, EQ score, and we'll go from there. Um, I personally have not taken this course, as it's brand new, so I cannot uh, give you any input on that one. But uh, you learn how to build better relationships, learn to stay calm, deal with stress more effectively, deal with difficult people, negative energy, achieve greater happiness, always a plus. Yes. Um, so here's kind of some of the things that are covered. What an EQ, emotional quotient, really means in practical, everyday, real-world terms. Why it's a more important success, success oh, uh, sorry, Easy for success, you to say. <laughs> I know, <laughs> factor than IQ. Uh, how to identify oh. your current level of EQ. So you got lots of things kind of going on. Uh, some surefire strategies on how to deal and how to develop truly healthy EQ. I feel it's like this. One. I feel like this course could just be, you know, a. Uh, you could just use Donald Trump as a textbook example of emotional quotient and how to handle people with a uh, low uh, happiness uh, EQ. Um, yeah, I think you might need that course to be dealing with him from what it sounds yes, like recently. Yes, how to stay positive around negative people. Yeah. yeah, this is all great. I mean, obviously great stuff. And mm -hmm. one thing about uh, the, um, the study of leadership is it's really evolved in the past uh, 10 to 20 years. Stuff like this never used to get discussed, uh, except in the most academic of academic journals. But now mm -hmm. people are really digging into it and understanding that's more than just competency in a job. You have to be able to actually, uh, you know, collaborate and work with other people. So, um, you know, if uh, Carrie can put up with me day to day, I'm sure that uh, this can be helpful to other. Five times today. This five is times. Getting this impressive. is right. This is right. So <laughs> icba.ca slash training. Now, Carrie, yesterday. We had our first ever um, mock evacuation drill here. We did indeed. At the uh, ICBA. You, of course, are uh, the chairwoman of the uh, Joint Health and Safety Committee here at, at ICBA. I am I'm trying to keep everybody safe. We're pretty high up in a building yeah. now, so it's a little if bit more I, of a necessary situation. If I fall, if I trip, if I bump my head, um, Jenny, if you're watching this, my wife, Sue Carey, she's in charge of the committee. Oh, um, clearly, she misdiagnosed uh, something. No, in, in, in our old building, we were on the uh, second floor, and some of us were actually on the ground floor, so mm -hmm. uh, evacuation was pretty simple. You know, go out the uh, stairs, or if I uh, have my plan, which was um, there was a piece of steel rebar in my office, I would plan to break the windows and just jump out to safety. Um, but, you know, here, we're on, the okay. seventh, we're on the seventh floor, so we have to go, like, you know, down dark stairwells and make sure we don't go too far down. And, you can end up in the parking lot, as some of us have found out. Luckily, I think everybody made it yesterday. We didn't have any casualties. No one tripped. No one fell. We all made it to the okay. muster point. It was pretty yes. good. You complained the entire way down. I, I went to the muster point, but that's fine. and then I mustered myself on over to Starbucks <laughs> and got myself a coffee. It was it was great. Um, good evacuation drill. The thing that the thing that concerned me though. Uh, Carrie, is that, you know, you were very clear, like, leave everything, just go, mm -hmm. uh, you know, you, you got to get out safe. I would like an assurance from you that in an evacuation, you will take your picture of you and Deb with you from your desk, if at all possible. I will do my absolute best uh, in a major situation. I don't know, but that's okay. okay. Um, I, you, you didn't mention the fact that I also have a photo of you on my desk now, that's right. too. That's great. The important people in my life, my mother, my husband, and now Jordan. And me. Excellent. And that is another Training <laughs> Thursday here at ICBA. We'll see you next week.